The origin of animal life is one of the most important events in the history of our planet. Many estimates suggest that animals had evolved by the Ediacaran period, some 600 million years ago, but all fossil evidence from this time has been met with controversy. At the centre of this argument are the rocks of the Doshantou Formation in southern China. Dated at around 600 million years old, these rocks preserve an assemblage of microscopic fossils known as the Wang'an biota, perfectly aged to be candidates for the oldest evidence of animal life. These fossils aren't recognisable as remains of fully grown animals, but some resemble embryos, ranging from single cells to clusters of thousands. The preservation is so exquisite that even subcellular structures can be identified, including possible nuclei. But without adult forms, paleontologists have to rely on cellular details to determine whether these tiny fossils belong to animals or some other group. Now, a team of researchers led by academics at the University of Bristol have reviewed all the evidence pointing towards an animal identity of the Wang'an fossils. It's been revealed that none of the characteristics previously used to define the fossils as animals are actually unique to animals alone, opening up the possibility for alternative identifications. Despite these results, paleontologists are continuing to make new discoveries from the Wang'an biota, and these are helping to refine our knowledge of evolution during the Ediacaran. It might be possible that we'll find definite animals in the Doshanto formation, but it'll be like finding a needle in a haystack, or should we say an embryo in a really, really big quarry. <laughs>